Property Mark's latest Housing Insight report still paints a picture of a rental market beset by overwhelming tenant demand versus a lack of supply of rental properties to the market. This report is fed by data from some of Property Mark's almost 18,000 members across the whole country, so it gives us a really accurate impression of what is going on in the rental market at the moment. Let's have a closer look. On average, we saw 91 new prospective tenants registering with each branch of a letting agent across the UK. Now, as you can see in this graph, um, there's that steady increase in the spring and summer of 2022 before dropping off in October of last year, which is really what happens traditionally as we get into the late autumn and winter. But as you can see at the start of this year, that number has started to increase and I'm sure we'll see interest grow gradually throughout the year once again. Um, you can also see that there is more interest in February 2023 from prospective tenants than there was in February 2022. So on average, the number of people looking to rent homes is on the rise. Now this report describes the supply of rental property to the market as steady, meaning that the number of properties coming to the market hasn't really varied at all over the last few months. It's been stuck at on average around nine new properties coming onto the market with each branch per month. And that's what it's stayed at during the last month. So whilst it's steady, it's important to note that the number of properties, the quantity of properties coming to the market is low. With 91 new prospective tenants registering per branch on average and nine available properties coming to the market, even I can work out that that's around 10 people registering for each available property. So we can see there's a clear imbalance between the number of properties coming to the market and the number of people who are trying to rent those properties. And we all know what that's done to rents. We've seen them go up steadily. So we'll have a quick look at rents next. 50% of the agents who provided data for this report reported that rents are still rising month on month, which is a very high figure, although that has come down a little bit from recent months, so a slight cooling of the market. But you'll see in blue here on this chart are the agents who have reported month on month rent increases. In orange, though, those are agents who say that rents have stayed the same month on month. And grey, the teeny tiny little section down at the bottom, those are agents who have seen rents dropping. So there are still a great many rents on the rise. And I think that as we get into spring and summer, we'll see even more people trying to rent properties and that may be on the up again. So a slight cooling off at the start of the year, but still 50% of rents are increasing. Nathan Emerson, Property Marks CEO, has summarized this all very nicely. He said the lettings market remains very much out of balance with an average of 10 registered applicants per property. As demand continues to outweigh supply, pressure on rents has eased slightly since the peaks of last summer, but it has by no means gone away. Well, I'll be very interested to see what happens over the coming months, and I will report back to you on future findings. My prediction is that this cooling off of rents will ramp up again in the peak summer months, just as it did last year, because we're not seeing any greater supply of properties to the rental market, and we're seeing more and more tenants trying to rent properties. So it's simple supply and demand. Unless we see more rental properties come to the market, I'm afraid rents will probably shoot up again this summer. I'll see you next time.